Welcome to the Art Lady channel. Today I have this gorgeous orchid flower that I picked from my tree and I have uh, several different colors here with me that come from the trees around my yard but I'm going to use these to show you uh, the different parts of the flower which is really quite amazing and there's an actual artist who paints all of the little designs that are inside the flower actually the reproductive parts and the petals and the pistils and the stamens. Uh, she paints all of that as a subject for her painting and her name is Georgia O'Keeffe. So if you research Georgia O'Keeffe, you can find some amazing paintings of the insides of parts of flowers. But we're gonna go ahead and learn the parts. Um, the first one I'm gonna talk to you about is the petal. Uh, the petal is actually the gorgeous part that surrounds the, in the center of our flower or the reproductive parts of our flowers right here. And I've picked one of our, my light pink ones here. So this is the petal of the flower right here. I think it's the pretty part or one of the beautiful parts. So these are petals of flowers and this orchid the center of the orchids on some of these have uh, four petals that are the same and then the center petal is has a beautiful coloration different different values of color here and gradations of color which is amazing and I'll show you on this one the light pink version yeah this is just gorgeous you can see why artists have painted these flowers or like to paint them and then this one's kind of fading because I picked them yesterday. So it's fading a bit, but it's a deep magenta color and the veining in here is gorgeous. But these are the petals that surround the center. Okay, the next one I'm gonna talk to you about are the pistil. And the pistil is the center, the, the very, very center part of our flower. So if we look in the center, we have some of these long stringy things sticking out. And the very center one here is a little bit different than the five other long ones. There's five long ones with these cool looking tips on top and I'll be talking about that after. But then the very middle one's a little bit taller and a little bit thicker right there. I'm gonna go ahead and for this one, I'm gonna go ahead and pick that piece and show you what it is. I gently pull it out so you can see it. And this is the pistil part of our flower. Let me put it on the back of this card here. So if we look close at the pistil, it has a thickness in the middle and this particular pistil has a little bit of a stripe down the side in red and then the center is yellow green. Inside the pistil is where we have some of our reproductive parts of our flower, the ov ovary, ovule. We have a pollen tube that runs up the whole thing. And then this top section is called the style. So let's get, I believe I have that word here. Oh, maybe I don't, but the top section here is called the style. And the very, very top of this is the stigma in the pistil. So this whole unit is called the pistil. And if I look, if we look closely, let's look real close, see if I can get it up here. The very tip of this is circular, okay? And That is called the stigma, the very top. It's like a light brownish tan color, right in there, okay? Now I'm gonna break this in half. Let's see if we can see this better, if I can focus it. If you break it in half, you may be able to see the pollen tube. Yeah, you can kind of see it on this one. It's a little tube in the center, so it's a bit hollow. And that goes right up the whole thing. So this is where all the reproduction happens for seed formation, right in there. And the pollen, of course, comes out. This is the part where the hummingbirds, I believe, 
are um, interested in. I'm not 100% sure, but these flowers do attract the hummingbirds. Um, they love them. Okay, so that's our pistil. Now I'm going to show you the stamens. Around that pistil are some stamens here. And these are the stamens right here. Let me get a pointer. These long, gorgeous tubes, these beautiful, see it right here? These long tubes. And then at the tip, there's the stamen. Let me, right there, there's the stamen. And I'm gonna show you on here, I have the petals um, pulled off this one, so you can see the five stamens right there. And they attach to the very center of the stem right there. Those are the stamens. And on top of the stamens is an anther. The anther. And that, these are really cool on this one. The anther are these long pieces here, but they actually tilt. They can tilt and move. You see that? That's really kind of cool. And there's actually, there was pollen on the top of that. But they tilt just like that. And this particular variety has five. Let me show you on. Oh, this little guy has some broken off. These tips, I think, got broken right here on the dark purple. Yeah, there's some pollen that comes off them right there. And you can actually see some pollen dust right in here. Oops, there goes my leaf. Or my petal. There's my petal. But there's some pollen dust right there. Now, on the, the part, the long stem of this, okay, is called a filament. So these pieces, these long stems that the anthers, anthers are sitting on top of, anther, that's the, that will be the anther. Then this long stem is the filament right here. So it's the stem, the, the line that it, the anther sits on top of. Those are filaments. And here you can see some are light pink and some are dark pink. Yeah, I'm not sure why these are missing. They could have been, they could have just fallen off. That's how they were when I picked the flower. Now at the very um, bottom of this plant, let me see if I can find one that works well. This of course, this part here where it attaches to the plant is the stem. That's our stem. And the part that surrounds the bud, so when this was all put back and small, it had some green covering the covering what makes the bud, and that is the sepal. Let me do a word here. That's the sepal. So that's the green part after the bud opens down here at the bottom. It's the sepal. This is our sepal. Let me show you on this one. Right there. This green part here. That's the sepal. On the flower. And there we have our parts of our flower.